guys and welcome back to my channel. And I think to myself, what a wonderful world. Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video, we are in a little bit of a different setting. We're actually in my dining room right now. Um, the background is completely like not decorated yet. And we are actually about to decorate for spring. So I have all of the stuff that I've recently bought laid out in front of me right here. And I'm just gonna go through and share with you guys my spring decor haul. I have stuff from Target, Home Goods, TJ Maxx, Marshalls. I even have some stuff from Joann's and yeah, so I just, I'm really excited to show you guys what I have and then we're gonna do, the next video will be decorating for Easter slash spring and this will get decorated, so will the kitchen and it's gonna be a lot of fun. So let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so first I'm gonna go through kind of some florals that I have and I'm sitting on top of our bench right here in our uh, on our dining room table just to show you guys everything but I have like literally so much stuff laid out. Um, the first thing is this bundle of yellow roses and I already kind of bent it so I could fit it inside of this little like watering can um, and it fits really well but yeah it's a beautiful little um, bunch of yellow roses and I really want to do some beautiful spring colors for um, this upcoming season so that's why I chose these and I love Joanne's um, bundle of flowers because they're always on sale and they're always very very full so like they even have leaves on them and yeah it's very beautiful i already took the tag off so i don't know how much it was and then i have this little robin's egg nest this was 3.99 i believe it was on sale but it's just like a little pick with little eggs inside super cute i think i'm just gonna chop the uh pick part off and just use the nest i don't know what for yet but for something and then also from joann's i have um, this actually came as two separate things, but this was a pick of uh, whatever these are, daisies maybe. And I stuck them in this yellow pitcher from their spring line. This was, okay, the tag's already off of it, so I don't remember, but very, very cute little combo. And I already kind of decorated it, so it looks really adorable. And then I have, actually we'll separate these. And then I have this other bunch of flowers. This was um, $9.99 on sale. And these are just pink. I think they're mums. Let's see if it says what they are. This is bush. Yeah, I think they're mums. But this color is so vibrant and gorgeous. And I like that they have a few tones to the flower petals. So that was really pretty. And then I have two sets of tulips. These are absolutely gorgeous. They had so many different colors of tulips. It was kind of hard to choose, but I definitely wanted to go with pink. So I got these pink and white ones. I think they had also just like plain pink ones by themselves, but I liked the kind of like um, combination of two separate colors. Um, these, these were $9.99. And then I also got the yellow tulips and they are just so beautiful. I think they're like really well done. The leaves are gorgeous. The stems are even like super, super thick. And yeah, they're very, very pretty. And I think that's actually everything that I got at Joann's. I didn't get too much. I really only go there for their floral stuff. And occasionally I'll get like a sign or something from there, but their florals are so good. I always go there pretty much every season to get my florals. And by the way, I haven't said this, but if you are new to my channel, welcome. I do just wanna say, this is one of my like other side hobbies. I mainly focus on body care and scents and candles on my um, channel here, but I also have a decorating hobby. I love decor. I love decorating my family's house for any season, especially Christmas. I had a lot of Christmas decorating videos. And yeah, if you guys are interested in any of that stuff, if that sounds good to you, then go ahead and subscribe down below. But let's just continue with the haul. So next I have some stuff from TJ Maxx. The first thing is this basket of eggs. This was $6.99. I thought it was so beautiful. It's like a little chicken wire basket with some, um, I think this is raffia, raffia, I don't know. Um, bow on top just super cute i thought the pastels are a really good color choice for spring and then along with that i think this fits really well it's like a little mini um, egg wreath and i think i want to put this by our coffee bar it was 14.99 i don't think that's a bad uh bad deal i think this is so beautiful and very well done that i don't mind spending that so there's that and then i also got this bunny garland this is the cutest thing look at their little colored bunny tails so cute this was $12.99 from tj maxx and yeah i'm very excited to use this it's so cute um next i have some pottery so if you guys haven't heard of ray dunn before 
you need to get on the train um, or don't because it's an addiction <laughs> but i am definitely a ray dunn collector as you can probably tell by the stuff behind me um, but i did find this home birdhouse i really like these two-tone um this two-tone line i think she's come out with a bunch of stuff in this color now where it has this like terracotta almost at the bottom and a little bow at the top and this was 19.99 i found this at home goods okay i hit the jackpot on ray dunn mugs for spring i found love my peeps and it has a pink like a baby pink inside this was 5.99 i found egg hunting and this has a baby blue inside. This is kind of like more that matte um, textured mug. This was $5.99 again. I think all the mugs are just $5.99. I found Hello Spring and it's in this beautiful light green. It's like a pale green. I don't, I haven't seen much in this color, but it's very, very pretty. And then I found Hot Mess Express. This doesn't really apply to spring, but I thought it was really cute with a baby pink inside. So very adorable i'll probably just drink my coffee out of it instead of decorate with it and then i found this all white mug in good egg i just thought it was cute nice for um for easter and then i found this beautiful yellow mug in chicks dig me so cute and i actually have an idea of what to put inside of this so i found this little guy at home goods and he was too cute to not bring home he was 4.99 and look at him Look at his little, little head bobbles and his little feathers and his little hat. He's so cute. So I think what I'm going to do is just like set him inside of the mug and hang the mug. He's just the cutest little thing ever. So I could not pass him up. The next thing I have is this big sign and it says happy, happy Easter. It's very beautiful. It's very heavy duty. Um, I love the wood tone on it and the little bunnies. This was $19.99 and also from home goods and then i found these adorable bunny canisters these are so cute so there's one little like big one and small one the big one is 9.99 and then the small one is 7.99 i think they even had a smaller one than this and a bigger one than this so there was a lot of options there was like a big and chubby one too but i liked those too and that is everything from home goods hey guys this is future victoria i actually went and stopped by home goods a couple days after filming this video and found a bunch of stuff so i wanted to show you guys just before we wrapped everything up but i have this cute little bunny plate oh my gosh it's so cute this was 12.99 and i found a big just set of carrots so i figure i can decorate with these and they'll be really good these were 9.99 and then i found a lot of mugs so this is beautiful day it has a little yellow handle and a yellow inside 5.99 and then I found Chick Magnet, so cute. And this was, let's see, $9.99. So the ones with the topper are $9.99. I found Hot Chick, so pretty. It's pink, I think I'm gonna use this year round, um, but it's perfect for um, spring. And then Peep Peep, which is this like shiny yellow. It's so gorgeous, again, $5.99. I found this salt pig. That's what they call it. I don't really know why it's called that, but it's supposed to be for you to put like your rock salt in, I think. And this is $9.99. I just think it's gorgeous and I've been wanting more kind of basic pieces. And then I also found this nest birdhouse. I think this is called the Tiki Birdhouse from Ray Dunn. And this was $19.99. I really, I don't think I have, I think I have one black birdhouse. So this would be my second one. I like to have like a black and white um, section for summer really for all year round, but especially for summer. So this would be good for that. And then I found this jelly beans set. So there's a pink mug and a baby blue, super gorgeous. This was $12.99 for the set. And then I found this little cake stand and it's just like a pastel yellow. This was $6.99. And I figure I could probably use this for summer as well. And so adorable, this little canister. It really looks like, like a Ray Dunn canister, but with bunny ears and stuff. And so I think I might actually, I don't even like the face on it, but I really like the, the ears. So I might just do the ears facing this way and then just do the back of the canister. But yeah, that's everything that I picked up on a different haul. So we're gonna move into Dollar Tree. I have a lot of stuff from Dollar Tree. Okay, the first few things that I have are just some actual like basket grass and it's yellow basket grass. I figured I could probably decorate with it. 
I, I really don't know how I'm gonna decorate with this, but I figured it would be nice as like a filler somewhere if it looks like empty. I can just like stuff this in there. And then it cannot be Easter without some eggs. So I got these like holographic or I guess iridescent eggs and I got three packs of them. Not sure where I'm gonna put them yet, but I'm glad that I have some because I like, you know, you have to decorate with the eggs for Easter, you just have to. And I also found these golden eggs. I don't know what I'm gonna do with them just yet, but um, I figured they were really cute. I might even just leave them wrapped up like this because it's pretty adorable, so. And then this isn't specifically Easter, um, but it is, it's kind of like all year round decor, but I could also put it up for Easter. Um, it's all these little crosses. So I had never seen these before at the Dollar Tree, but um, they had them in four different types. They had this one in Bless, and it's like gray. They had this one with a little bow on it, and it's just white. And then I think the same kind of white one, but instead it has grace on it and like, um, like 10 letters, they're metal. And then this one is metal with a brown cross in the middle of it. And these are just really pretty. They kind of remind me of stuff you'd see in Hobby Lobby. And my mom collects crosses, so I figured we can use this even like after um, Easter to decorate with, but I'll probably put them around places um, for Easter and then just use them as regular decor for the rest of the year. And then I got, I really didn't get a lot of florals. I usually get a lot of like filler florals from Dollar Tree, um, but I just only picked up three bunches of this bright, bright blue floral and they're just like super bright. I figured all these like fun colors would be really nice for like not only Easter, but for spring too. And then I did manage to find the little carrots. I wish I would've got like five sets of these to be honest with you, um, because they're really hard to find. But I found these, I think back in like January and I just picked them up on a whim. Um, but now I know they're super hard to find and I wish I would have picked up more, but that's okay. And then I did pick up two signs. So the first one is welcome and it has little bunnies on here with their little pom pom tails. Super cute. And then I also picked up this one that says happy Easter with a tin bunny on it and some eggs on the side. I hate how all of their signs are glittery. I wish they didn't do that, um, but they are still really cute even with the glitter on them. So it's, it's whatever, they're a dollar, <laughs> okay. Um, okay, now we're gonna move into Target and that's like the last store that I have stuff from. So first, uh, Target Dollar Spot. Actually, I think everything here is from the Target Dollar Spot. So um, first thing, I wanted to go in and pick up one of these little trees. I actually saw these, I think on Instagram and I died at how cute they were. So I picked up one in pink and I just thought it was really adorable. And then I also found the ones in white, but they're in um, little terracotta pots and I got two of them and I figured I could put them like side on each side of like the hutch or um, somewhere else and they'd be really nice and like symmetrical, but also really pretty. And I can use these kind of any time of year as well since they're just white. Literally my mom just texted me that she's at Marshall's right now and she found some Ray Dunn stuff. Look how funny. She found like a happy Easter and a little bunny. So should I get it? I don't know. Okay, sorry, off topic. Anyways, um, the next thing I picked up also from the Target Dollar Spot are these beautiful little egg trees. Like this is the cutest thing ever. These were $5 each and they're like actually pretty big. They're bigger than the, um, the white ones, which the white ones are only $3, so there's a little size comparison for you, but they are super cute and they have multicolored um, pastel eggs on them and it's just so adorable. So I will definitely be using these in our decor. And then I was able to find the bunny ear measuring cups. These were $3. Everybody uh, posted about these on Instagram and everybody loves them and died for them. These were the like, the last ones in my store and so i was very lucky to find those i also picked up a few candles from the dollar spot i have one in happy easter and it's this baby blue and then one in hello spring in like this sage green color and then i got two egg holders and these are like little bunnies with ears they're just ceramic and they were a dollar each i also got these little bunny salt and pepper shakers these were three dollars so cute. I'm not gonna use them for salt and pepper. I'm just gonna use them to decorate with, just like put them in odd places around. And then I picked up these actually, I think in January, but they're just like little rings of leaves. And I figured it's really pretty to decorate with kind of any, um, any time of year. So just good to have little like things like this that you can 
transition throughout your seasons and just decorate with whenever. And then I also picked up a couple things of towels and um, pot holders. So the first one is this gray one with a bunny on it and a little pom-pom tail with a gray pot holder. And then locally grown and organic carrot patch. Um, little towel with some like green stitching at the bottom. I just noticed that and then a green pot holder. So um, We have like a little towel bar uh, for our coffee bar stand And so I like to get towels every season for that So that's what those will be for and then I did pick up some more carrots from the dollar spot These were a dollar each and they're little fabric carrots. Um, they're almost like um, this is material I don't remember what the material is, but yeah, they're really pretty and they're just like orange carrots. They had, I think, pink and blue, but I really just wanted orange just to keep with the season. And then I also got this um, ceramic cutting board. This was $5 and it has like a little bunny up here at the top, but I figured I could probably use this year round and just kind of like put something in front of here or like tie a bow around it or whatever. And you'll never be able to tell that it's just like an Easter themed cutting board. And this would be really cute to decorate with. Just whenever and then the last last thing for this entire haul is this little tiny happy easter sign from the dollar spot for a dollar just really cute and yeah that's everything that i have for the haul i hope that you guys enjoyed this a little bit and got to see kind of um everything that's out there because easter's coming up in a month and also if you just want to decorate for spring there's a lot of like cool stuff out right now for springtime to start decorating and yeah i'm really excited to get some like spring vibes going in here we've kind of had it bare ever since i took down all the christmas decorations so i am excited to get decorating and we'll get started in that for the next video so look out for that in a couple of days that'll be coming out but yeah thank you guys so so much for watching and i will see you in the next video bye